Good day guys and welcome back again to another video and today I'm going to just talk about some things and according to my post I will do some story videos um, story type videos where I just tell some stories and just just talk about some experiences and how I how I enjoyed playing BG and just much more <laughs> Any, anything really I want to talk about so yeah I'll be doing more vids like this um, story type videos aside from tips and tricks videos because I think for me it's it's a bit my channel it's um, full of tips and tricks already so why, why not make more videos like this and yeah for this video I will be talking about tree finger and it's about using three fingers while playing the game because I, I, I got known for it a lot. Um, only in BG of course, but in other games, not that much because a lot of other players use it. But but only in BG, like I get known for it a lot. So yeah, if you don't know it, it's basically using three fingers because normally you will use two fingers for playing, li right? While playing the game, you use the thumb for moving and the thumb for hitting and jumping and the, the right thumb, you use it for anything else aside from the left which you will be using for your moving, right? But in three finger, you, you, you would use different fingers to control your player more, like you use your left pointer finger or, or even the left thumb, it doesn't really matter for the left hand. Um, you only use it for the controlling, the movement, and yeah. And for the right finger, you use the thumb for jumping. And sometimes for um, selecting weapons in the hotbar. And the right pointer finger, you use it for hitting. And that's the main point around three finger. So, I, I want to talk about how I learned it. Because um, in the Q&A video... Uh, a lot of you ask how I learned it, and I answered that I was playing a game, and let, let's just talk about it deeper. So, I learned it from the game called Rules of Survival. If you don't, if you don't know that, it's just basically a battle royale game where it's just a FPS game. If you don't, if you don't know that, it's first person, first person shooter game, and it's with guns and you just fight to death like la the last one standing wins y you know the type of game you will loot houses get some guns and ju just try to survive and first of all I didn't start already with three finger I, j I also used two finger like anybody else did because it's it's normal it's like natural to use two fingers because because why not? It's just easy to control with two fingers. But then, then I saw some pro players like in YouTube. They they, they use more fingers. Like I was like, how how did they do that? Like th that's so skilled. So I tried searching. Some some people use eight. I don't I don't really know how to use eight fingers. Some use six. Some use four. And Any, anything really more than two fingers. I think for me they are skilled. I don't know why, but yeah, I search how to, how to do something like that. I I tried using four, but I I found it it hard a bit hard for me, so I just search three and and I, I found really something good. I, I used a tablet by the way back then, it was like 2018. Um, so at, at the tablet I just used, um, I think it was left thumb for moving and then left left um, pointer finger also for shooting and well the right thumb I think it was it was for moving and uh, other like sneaking um, you know that movement in battle royale games where you just it that lay down thing it's called prone it's the prone and yeah I started three finger from that so I ended up using more fingers like that. Sometimes I used four, but it didn't last long. Like in a week, I just removed it because it I found it a bit hard for my hands to um, play with it. But but that's totally normal. Like in the first weeks, you'll you'll not be pro as immediately. 
you, you need practice by the way like on the first days on using it, it it will be painful a bit for your hands but as you progress you you will get better at it I promise you'll get better at it so I kept doing that and for a month I practiced it more in that rules of survival game and eventually after months um, I got very used to it and I, I tried playing other games and that game was PUBG. I, I just moved it to PUBG. It is player unknown's battlegrounds if I remember correctly and it, it's just like rules of survival but it was made from um, other companies but but the idea of the game is still the same it's still a battle royale game where you you loot houses and kill other players and survive and yeah he just uh, the the control settings I just copied it from the rules of survival I continued using tree finger and yeah I also switched to phone in that times because the phone was better than the tablet and yeah, instead of using left um, pointer, I, I use right pointer. And that that's si very similar to BG now because um, I used right pointer finger and the right thumb for the right hand. A and it, it's just like that. That's how I did it for BG. Now let's go, go ahead to BG now. And... And yeah, I know how to play Tree Finger in PUBG. And the time that I got interested more in Minecraft in um, Android. And yeah, I played BG and uh, I only I remember that in my first weeks of BG, I only used two finger. I don't know why, but but I I was like playing PUBG and BG at the same time and sometimes Minecraft for a bit. And it's like I just used three fingers on PUBG and I used only two on BG, which um, I, I don't recommend as of now because it's hard to play with that. Like for for the other game, you will use three and for this other game, you will use two. You, you will not get used to it. And um, I got a catch up on the BG on training on BG. In, in terms of progress, I switched to three finger and I was like searching for videos how to improve on PvP in BG and I was like you need you need to stray from left to right and I got that from some old BG tubers video and I just kind of followed it like everybody did and now I, I'm the one who does tips and tricks like that but yeah and so so how i implied implied um the three finger thing i i just asked myself um why not jump why not jump while strafing left to right will that be harder for you to be uh, a harder target to hit and I, w I was like sure why not let's let's do three finger and i started jumping in pvp i don't I don't know I don't really know because back then th there was no other videos that um, pr proving that trick that that just just basically jumping and creating will do more damage but I, I didn't really focus on that I didn't um, <laughs> search for videos because I wasn't really interested on those things <laughs> and and yeah I just jumped for no reason without realizing that it will be OP for the next months. So yeah, it was like 2020 of January, February, March. Those those starting three months, I started to um, pick up some skills on BG. Then around April, I, around April of last year, that that is only the time where I started to realize that. Uh, my gameplay was a bit different because I, I was the only jumping like it does it that feel weird like everyone does combos like strafing left to right forward backward while me it I find it a bit weird because I'm th I'm the odds one out like like I'm the only one jumping so yeah I I got some people like friends that 
they said how how I do that that's literally impossible to jump while hit while moving and I was like no no it's just using three fingers and they was like can you teach me and I showed them a picture of how I did it and I can't really explain to them because I I don't know how to explain it so I left that for her I left the idea of teaching them because I wasn't that good at teaching them so yeah instead of of strafing left to right I it helped me to enjoy the game it helped it it really helped me to enjoy BG because P PvP was um, enjoyable when I was jumping I, d I don't know why because for me just moving left and right it, it's a bit boring it's a bit boring if you take a closer look but but yeah it it really helped me on how to enjoy to enjoy to enjoy the game and also around i think it was april or may last year i just i started my youtube channel and i tried making three finger content but i just labeled it as bedwars content and just normal i i don't focus on my youtube back then last year and let's go to the next month like it was like june or july when i started making more videos and at, at august i did the hand cam and and it, it it did well it did well but not that much but I, you know it's something it's something that i can start with me with my channel and my channel started blowing up around that time because of the um the, they found it unique the hand cam hand cam is short for hand camera if you don't know and i i have lots of videos about that like how i play and stuff like that and and that's how i growed my channel like posting lots of different content that just feels a bit unique from the others because lots of other bg tubers they, they they make lots of funny moments so why why not stop making them for for my channel for my channel i'm talking about but so yeah i started making hand cam videos and that that's all that's where that's where it started and even bigger youtuber youtubers noticed me like drunk and that that was the time when he commented on my video on uh, the three finger video he he even noticed me in that video and y you can see a lesson there like do do something iconic for for yourself and other people will notice you e very easily um do, do something very iconic and unique and that's how i get i that's how i got known for something in the B in the BG community, and I just continued making videos, playing games, um, and and even have some friends um, to to teach because why why not? Um, and later then when when my um, I know I finally know how to edit properly. I I made a tutorial and I I will link it in the description. Because why, why not? For new people in my channel, I, I have lots of videos on hand camps. You can you can see it in the description for yourself. And that's pretty much all on how I learned three finger. And so don't forget to subscribe, like like this video, and use my G Star code. It will really help me. So. It, any more um, suggestions or what, whatever you want to add in my videos, in the story type of videos, because um, it's it's been a while when I uh, make more grinding tips and tricks because I just got bored of making those. So yeah. Anyway, stay safe and I I wish you have a good day.